Hey guys, today let's play a game of Sonic the Hedgehog 4, which is um, officially the sequel to Sonic 3, of course. Um, but when it came out, I think a lot of people were not quite enamored with this game. I mean, sure it was better than a lot of the other Sonic games released before this, but uh, it basically when Sonic Mania came out, it just kind of overshadowed this game. Um, when I first picked up this game, Episode 1 and Episode 2, it was for the uh, iPhone actually, because it was actually a mobile game. Um, and, you know, I wanted to see what Sonic 4 was about, but, yeah, I don't think it's as good as the first three Sonic games, of course, um, but it's not terrible or anything. It's not like um, Sonic 2006, obviously. It's not like uh, um, Sonic Unleashed. Those games weren't that great. Um, then again, you know, there's other great Sonic games on mobile platforms as well, like Sonic CD. I think it's really good. Um, and, uh, yeah. Um, it's better than Sonic 3D Blast as well, I would say. <laughs> so, but that's not saying too much. Anyways, Sonic 4 Episode 1. Let's get this started. I'm gonna play Episode 1 and Episode 2. It's been a long time since I played this game. The last time was... This game came out in 2010, originally. So it's been a while. I think I got this back in 2012 or something. 2011 or 2012 or something like that. Alright, uh, let's begin the new game. And I don't think you can change any characters in this one. No, nope. you can only choose Sonic. No Knuckles, no Tails, nothing. And, um, yeah, it, I mean, look at the graphics. It just... <laughs> I mean, I know they, they wanted to go for 3D graphics, but this looks like a cheap, like, fan-made fan mod or something like that. Yeah, this doesn't even feel like it was uh, done by, like, a proper studio. <laughs> I mean, it doesn't feel like a lot of budget was put into this. It looks almost like a Flash game. And you can tell that it was originally meant for mobile too. Like this is originally meant for like iPhone and Android. And you can kind of tell from the graphics it looks like a flash game almost. So graphics are definitely... The graphics definitely not that great. Yeah, Sonic just, it just looks off. He does not he look like proper Sonic. He looks very off. There are some good 3D Sonic games though, like Sonic Heroes. I actually do like Sonic Heroes a lot. And that was actually one of my favorite 3D Sonic games. Sonic Adventure 1 and 2, I think are really good 3D Sonic games as well. Yeah, so there are not all Sonic 3D games are bad. There are some good ones. Sonic Adventure 2 and Heroes are probably my favorite ones. But, you know, of course, most of the bad Sonic games are 3D Sonic games. Yeah, I think especially Sonic 2006 and Unleashed. Triple <laughs> Man. Those are not good. Yeah, I remember. I do remember playing Unleashed back in the day. It was, like, really weird. Sonic Generations was pretty good. Sonic Colors was okay. I think this is about as good as Sonic Colors. I don't think it's as good as Generations, but I think it's about as good as, as Colors, which is to say it's a fairly mediocre Sonic game. Not terrible, but not the best ones either. Yeah, about similar to Sonic Colors, I'd say, is what this episode one is Sonic for. Alright. Yeah, you can now play uh, Splash. Is that Splashville Zone? Let's see what you can do. Oh yeah, the pinball stuff. They did this in Sonic CD already. Oh, there we go. 
Lockout system was basically taken from 3D Sonic games. That, that was there for 3D Sonic games. Sonic music is usually pretty good, but the music of Sonic 4 Episode 1 just seems off. <laughs> it just doesn't seem that great as other Sonic games. Like, uninspired, I guess, is what I want to say. Like, Sonic 3 and Sonic Knuckles had probably the best music. But, yeah, and Sonic 2 had really good music as well, but Sonic 4... I think it's pretty kind of fun. All these acts, anyways. Is there, are they part of movies? Is Sonic part of a movie? What do they call these acts? <laughs> Lost Labyrinth Zone, Mad Gear, Let's try these. World of Darkness. Oh, I can choose which act to play. Okay, cool. Whoa. I can barely see anything. What's going on here? I can't see anything.
Okay. stuck here now. <laughs> I'm stuck here. I'm doing another act. Uh, stay select. That labyrinth, that labyrinth stage is awful. <laughs> Pushing me back here. Anyways, um, this is Sonic 4 Episode 1, it's a very mediocre Sonic game, um, yeah, I mean there's definitely better Sonic games to play, so, uh, yeah, what can I say, um, it's a very middle of the road Sonic game, it's not terrible, but it's not great, uh, either, so, yeah, I probably do, there's a lot many, uh, there's a lot more Sonic games, many other Sonic games I'd rather play than Sonic 4. Episode one, <laughs> and you can only play a Sonic too. And the graphics are weird. I would say it looks kind of like a Flash game, and the music's off. Um, some of the stages are not very fun to play. So, anyways, uh, that's it. Sonic Four, guys. Episode one. Thanks for watching. <laughs>